In this video, I want to go over the Fibonacci sequence on Code Wars. And what it states is you need to create a Fibonacci function that, given a signature, which will be an array or a list, returns the first n elements signature included of the associated sequence. Now, they give us some uh, pretty good examples that I'm going to show you down here. So let's zoom in. So the signature in this case, so if you look up here to the method, um, the signature, it's going to pass us two input values. The signature and n. So the signature is going to be a list of three integers. Using these three integers, we need to find the first ten elements of the Fibonacci sequence. Um, obviously, n will be can be different. It can be ten. It can be a hundred. It can be a thousand. It can be any given number. The signature will always be of length three, but it can be obviously, as you see, of um, different types of signatures. So it can be three hundred, two hundred, one hundred and so, so, so on and so forth. So using this example with the signature 111 to find the first 10 uh, elements of that array, what we do is given the signature 111 to find each subsequent integer, we just add the last three integers. So 111 would give us 3, 311 will give us 5, 531 will give us 9, and so on and so forth. You get the idea. However, there will be certain situations to where n will be smaller than the length of the signature. So in this case, with the signature 111 and n being 1, we just return the very first uh, integer. And there will also be instances where the n will be 0 and we need to return an empty list. Now the way we're going to do this is actually quite simple. What we're going to do is they give us a signature already. So what we can do is we can append to the end of this signature list the sum of the last three integers before it. And the way we're going to do this is with a while loop. So we can just say while, while the length of signature is less than n, what we're going to do is we're going to take that signature and append to it the sum of the last three integers in that signature list. So we can just say signature dot append, and what we're going to say is the sum. We're just going to use the sum function, and we're going to say signature. We're going to use some list slicing. We're going to say the last three all the way to the end of the list, and that is actually it. What we need to do from here is just return uh, the the signature. So return um, signature. But remember, there will be instances where n will be smaller than the length of the signature list. And to take care of this, what we can do is, um, from the very beginning of the list, 2n. So say they give us a signature of length 3, and n is 1. The length of signature is 3, here, and n will be 1. So this while loop will never execute. What we will then return is from the beginning of the list to the first element. So we'll just return the first element. And this takes care of all the cases where the n is smaller than the length of the signature list. So if we uh, test this, this should work. OK, 10 passed. Uh, let's attempt it. And OK, all 4,000. Wow, that's a lot of test cases. All 4,010 test cases passed. Um, that will be the end of the Fibonacci sequence tutorial. I hope that you learned something. And if you did, I would appreciate it if you liked, commented, and subscribed. And I will see you guys in future tutorials.